As you document your process, IBM BlueWorks Live automatically lays out the diagram for you. This saves a lot of time and keeps you focused on the content of the process. Occasionally, you may want to slightly change the arrangement of the items to tidy things up a bit. To facilitate this, BlueWorks Live allows you to move an item to the top, bottom, left, or right of any previous item in the diagram, just by dragging and dropping. To see how this works, drag an item on the diagram to a previous item and look for the gray bar indicating a valid drop point. The only restriction is that you can't drag items to the right of items in your process flow, since that would rearrange the sequence of activities in your process diagram. Otherwise, you can move things around as you like. If you make a change that produces undesirable results, you can simply hit the undo button to reverse the change. If you create a layout that you cannot easily fix as desired, you can right click on the background of the process diagram and reset the layout to the original auto layout. One specific challenge is laying out parallel flow in a process. When you have parallel flow of activities coming out of an activity or a decision gateway, there are often several items that need to be repositioned to get the desired layout. To simplify the positioning, right click on the item that splits the flow and select Align Parallel. The diagram is refreshed with the parallel paths aligned as you would expect. We hope this video helped you understand how you can reposition items on the diagram and how you can use the Align Parallel option to achieve your desired process layout. Stay tuned to the BlueWorks Live channel on YouTube for new innovations and videos from IBM. If you have any questions or feedback, contact us at support at blueworkslive.com.